Today is Thanksgiving, a day to spend with your family and give thanks. But for some people in Denver, they may not have a place to go to or anyone to celebrate with. So Denver 7's Ivan Rodriguez is live this morning to explain how the Salvation Army is helping make sure families have a nice, warm holiday meal. Ivan. Good morning. Things are just starting to get started here at the Salvation Army. Behind me, you can see trays of, of food and food bags starting to come in. They're going to be making 2,800 meals today, and that's up from 1,500 just last year. I'm joined with Rachel from the Salvation Army. Is there a greater need this year, would you say, than even just, just last year? There's absolutely a greater need, and we've seen it across the board this year. Whether it's our food boxes or our rent assistance or our utility assistance, people are coming to us for help, and often for the first time, we're serving people that we've never served before, people who never thought that they would need to come to us for help. And um, we're there for them. And, you know, it's it's seen when we're almost doubling our Thanksgiving efforts this year. And we see people running back and forth, bringing food in. The kitchen is just right behind us. Sort of explain for us, what are we going to be seeing here as sort of the morning progresses? Yeah, as the morning progresses, we're going to see even more trays going back and forth. We're going to be loading up um, bags of food for their to-go meals that have your full Thanksgiving meal, the turkey, the mashed potatoes, potatoes, the mac and cheese, everything will be there. Um, and what we're going to do with those is we're going to take those to 14 locations across Denver Metro. Um, actually more than that because we'll also be taking our canteen out to the streets as well. And if we take a little bit of a walk this way, maybe we can see some of this. What, what was inside of these bags here you were so, telling me? So this is the beginning of some of the meals. If you take a look at some, um, we've got some chips, we've got the silverware going. So all of this is kind of the prep work that's laid ahead of time. So that way, when we cook the meals and get all the hot food, we can start packing those up. And we, want, we also want to continue to help out with this as well. And from the Scripps Howard Foundation, we wanted to present you guys with this check here. $10,000 um, from the Scripps Howard Foundation as well as Denver 7 to continue to help with your guys' mission to, to help these people in need. Unlike many other years uh, prior to that, more people in need now more than ever. Thank you so much. You know, this is so incredibly generous and we love to work with Denver 7 and the Scripps Howard Foundation. And something like this just shows that if we partner together, we can make amazing things happen in the community. Thank you so much. Guys, we'll bring it back to you. From here, we're going to start seeing more of those meals start making their way out. Hopefully it will give people a nice break from a difficult year.